important was it for you to kind of have a bounce back game today? I, mean, I, think was, I think it was important for our whole team to have a bounce back game, not just myself. Um, I think the whole team as an offense played really well. Um, I mean, we're going to watch the film and see how we did, but uh, just off the top of my head, I know I wish we finished better in the red zone, obviously, and uh, get more points there. Okay, it's two weeks in a row you've been in the 40 yard, 40 attempt range for you. you expect to get that kind of workload every week? Uh, I think it's whatever, you know, how the game goes. That's how Coach Hope calls it. Um, you know, he's got a great mind for the game, and I trust him 100% with the play calls he's got. How uncomfortable do you feel throwing the French? It seems like that's the guy you're looking for. Uh, I mean, I'm not looking for him. He's just getting open, and uh, you know, with the play calls that we have, um, you know, Tacey has been doing a great job. Will Bragg stepping up this year, big. Uh, I think he's just going to continue to improve. Uh, the kid getting his hands on the ball a little bit more was good to see. So, uh, you know, we just got to keep taking the steps in the right direction. How important has it been to use some of those shorter plays that turned into big gains and to set up some of the bigger ones downfield? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's easy. Uh, you know, we like to call those like extended runs. Just put the ball out there and let our guards go out in space and do what they do best. Um, you know, getting Maurice more touches in space, I think, was, a, it was an emphasis in this game plan and letting him go do his thing. So, obviously, it was a positive. Okay, how much more comfortable are you working with the tight ends now this year as opposed to last year? Uh, I just think they're involved more, you know. Um, there's more plays, you know, directed towards, the, towards their way, getting the number called a little bit, um, spreading the ball around. So uh, I think it will continue to be more comfortable as, as the year goes. Did you feel more comfortable today than last week? I mean, I felt comfortable last week. Um, I was real happy with the game plan. You know, it felt good um, going over it multiple times with Coach. Did the same thing again this week. Uh, I just think we executed better all around, not just myself. You know, the offensive line, the block's great. Receivers got open, and uh, it was just clicking. Kenny, did you hear any of the kind of frustration, the fan frustration maybe from last week? No, I, mean, I deleted all social media during the season, so I don't pay attention to any of it. Kenny, I've got to ask, I mean, this is we'll talk to you this week. How prepared do you think you guys are for, for next Saturday? What gives you confidence that you guys will be able to put last year behind? I mean, no one's thinking about last year. We're just going to enjoy this one, uh, prepare hard like we do every game. Uh, you can't treat weeks different than other weeks. I think you have to go about your business like a pro every single week, and you'll be fun. Did you know as the game was going on, kind of, do you, do you generally have a sense of where your stat line is? I mean, you ended up with a career high in passing yards today. I mean, were you kind of aware when you crossed that 300 yard plot? No, I mean, I'm not really sure where I'm at in the game. Uh, the only thing is score points and, and, and win the game. That's the only thing I'm on I'm on playing. How do you feel about the career high? I feel good. And my, my teammates help me out a lot. It's not nothing to celebrate about. I think those guys did a great job and they helped me out a lot. Um, so, you know, we'll enjoy it, celebrate as a team, and, and move on to next week. Your running game kind of inconsistent through the, the first game and, and a large part of today, and then you guys have that drive at the end of the game. How good, of, how much of a kind of a boost was that for you guys if it closed it out like that? Right. I mean, I think that was something going to that last drive that we emphasized that you know we wanted to run the ball and, and just ice the game and, and get out of there with the win. Um, so you know, seeing those guys work hard up front and getting Vincent Davis in there, getting him some touches, I think he showed some flash. Uh, he's got some juice that you know we all like to see. So I think he, he did a great job. Kenny, did you just delete Twitter from your phone? Or? Yeah, yeah, I deleted Twitter, um, Instagram. I keep Snapchat because my friends are on there. I only keep it to close friends on my Snapchat. So, uh, yeah, really, that's it. Just kind of focused right now. What will you uh, do tonight? You got a lot of time here. For yeah, well, my, I got some family and friends. I definitely want to see them and just watch the games and kick back, relax for a little bit while I can. Kenny, did you feel like the offensive line, as the game wore on, they started to protect you a little better and obviously get more push too? Yeah, I mean, I mean, I trust those guys a lot. Um, you know, Jimmy and those guys work really hard. Um, I talk with them out there every series to see how they're feeling. Um, you know, I think they had a pretty good uh, key on what, what Ohio was trying to do, and, and they locked it down pretty good for me out there. Anything final for Kenny? So give it those family and friends. <laughs> <laughs> you watch